So yesterday I put out that video about Dove Soap being upset and mad over Brendan Fraser winning an Oscar for The Whale because Brendan Fraser is not a 600 pound obese man. He wore a fat suit to play the role of an obese man. And that's why they're upset. It hurts the fat community or something. It's absolutely ridiculous, I, I understand. Um, but this just might take the cake on that. This might be the most insane and hilarious meltdown in this whole situation. You're going to want to strap yourselves in for this one. Transgender pro-fat doctor is furious at four thin, white, rich, able-bodied cisgender men behind the whale movie after it wins Oscar awards. This whole sentence was hard to get through. This is just, this right here just tells you you're not dealing with a serious person. A transgender UK doctor known for being a fatness advocate expressed outrage that thin people were being celebrated for the whale movie at the Oscars awards ceremony on Sunday. A fatness advocate doctor. If, you, if you're a fatness advocate doctor, you're not a real doctor. Okay, just throwing it out there. If this is your doctor, run away. The movie about a man dealing with his obesity problem and directed by Darren Aronofsky garnered Oscar awards for best makeup and hairstyling and for best actor. Dr. Uh, Asher Larmy, who also identifies as non-binary, that's important to know, unleashed a furious tirade on Twitter over the fat-phobic incident. Quote, Once again, just a reminder that The Whale was written by, directed by, and produced by four thin, white, rich, able-bodied cisgender men. Oh, and check out its fat star who was celebrated and honored at the Oscars last night. What a effing joke. No, the only joke here is you bitching about this whole situation, okay? He's an actor. That's what he does. He plays roles. Uh, that, it, these people seem to think that you have to be the thing that you're pretending to be. He wore a fat suit because it was going to be damn near impossible to find someone who could pull this off being 600 pounds, okay? Like I said, these people have health problems. They're obese. They can't get out of bed. They can't stop eating. It wasn't going to work, okay? That's just the way it is. Are we able to wrap our heads around this one yet, folks? Someone won an Oscar for making Brendan Fraser a currently straight-sized man, whatever that means, that's a new one, but they made him look fat. No one else finds this disturbing, for fuck's sake? No. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. The, the movie has been celebrated as a career comeback for Frazier after he left the industry over sexual harassment that he faced from a movie executive. A video of his fans giving him a standing ovation was circulate, uh, circulated uh, widely as a touching and emotional moment, but exoriated by fat advocates for its inherent problematic fat phobia. Frazier tearfully accepted the Oscar for Best Actor on Sunday. Larmy later lashed out at his detractors. The fat haters are out in numbers today. Imagine thinking you're so smart when all evidence suggests otherwise. No, I'm pretty sure the evidence suggests that uh, you're wrong about this and that being obese is not healthy. It's very unhealthy, okay? Stop advocating for people being fat. But once again, I am no doctor, so what do I know? Waste your breath somewhere else. You're not getting the reaction you want out of me today. Larmy is known for claiming that obesity causes no health problems. Yep, see, right there. Yeah, that's how you know. Don't take this doctor seriously. If you have this doctor, run away. Don't go to them, okay? This person is a joke. But, uh, yeah, uh, this person was getting so much heat for their comments on this that they, you know, uh, they shut off the comments because they were getting absolutely destroyed for coming out and saying this stuff, trying to make themselves be a victim for being fat. They think it's an identity. It's not. It's a condition. You're, you're overweight. You're unhealthy. Okay, uh, put down the fork, go out, exercise, eat healthier. You know, uh, you'll feel better and you'll look better. Okay, but it, once again, I'm no doctor, so what do I know? But, you know, let me know what you guys think about all of this in the comments. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I will talk to you later.